What's up guys, Big D Wiz here. Got two El Cheapo amplifiers we're gonna test for you guys today. So say you didn't have a whole lot of money, you had about 70 bucks, you got a choice between the Pyramid PB449X and the Lanzar Heritage HTG257. This one says it's a 2,000 watt amp. This says it's a 1,000 watt amp. I don't think either one is right, but let's find out on the dyno. So first off, we'll do a certified run. Four ohms. Each amp, uh, Lanzar is on channel one. Pyramid's on channel two. They're both bridged. See which one's got the most power. All right, looks like Lanzar 297 and Pyramid 206. All right, now let's try the dynamic test at four ohms. Again, Lanzar channel one, Pyramid channel two. Which one has the most dynamic power? Looks like Lanzar for the win, but not that much of a win and nowhere near its rating of 1,000 watts bridged at four ohms. So let's go back and try a two ohm. Start dyno, start track two. Feeding it right at 15 volts. What can these bad boys do? Plans are busting 500 watts. 543 to the pyramids 385. Well, looks like for the wattage, the Lanzar wins. For the looks, the pyramid wins. For your wallet, you lose because you don't get anywhere near the rated power. Even in dynamic mode, two ohms mono, one kilohertz burst tone. Nowhere near the ratings on either one of these. So. All right, so after the dyno test, we decided to use the AMM1 with a four ohm subwoofer. You can see here with the Pyramid, we got 217 watts. And with the Lanzar, we got 299 watts. So I hope you enjoyed the dyno drag. This is Big D Wiz, until next time, I'm out of here.